You look good. Everything you you centered perfect. Yours, <laughs> um, existentially and figuratively, literally, we're centered perfectly. Thanks for getting. <laughs> David <laughs> thanks for getting on the uh, morning broadcast today. You know, some people ask me if this is real, what's going on here in Florida. What do you tell them? No, this is a real market that you're seeing with so many sales happening every single day. Um, it's a hot market, and I almost call it dumb hot because there's no logic to this market, but it's real supply and demand. So I always tell people there's never been a better time to buy, but you got to be prepared and you have to do your homework. And you need a real estate professional like you that can guide them. So when the opportunity comes up, they need to act on it right away. You can't wait until tomorrow because it won't be here tomorrow. So you got to be prepared, know what your budget is, know what your goals are, and then act on those goals. And, you know, once you win the golden ticket and you get your bid accepted, um, that's, a, that's an exciting time. That's exciting to know, having that golden ticket and that you have a closing date. For all the people who are sitting on the sideline and they think, well, I'll wait a couple of years, what are you telling them? Well, that's great. And we talked about this a few podcasts ago, but I can tell you countless stories. And I know you can too. The people that bought two years ago felt the same way. Everybody always feels that way. They're nervous. They're apprehensive. Is there a bubble? What's going to happen to the market? But what we can tell you is the people that took that leap of faith two years ago and even last year with Corona Everyone said, hey, don't buy. There's a virus. Those people are already seeing instant equity, meaning the property prices are going up, not down. So they're making money and they get a nice place to live and pride of ownership. So, you know, just, you know, I'm doing another loan for somebody that bought a home three years ago and they were a first time buyer. They just made $75,000, Sandra, when they sold that house. And these are people that make 18 to $19 an hour. They're never going to accumulate that kind of wealth. And the, here they are selling the home, making $75,000. They can take that money, put it on a, their new home, which was what they did. And, you know, yes, there's some stress because how do you time it? That's why they need you. They need a great realtor like you. You can time it. If you listen to the professionals, we can guide you and get you in there with little or no stress. Little or no stress. And just helping people make a decision and giving them choices. In particular price points, next year, those homes in the same price point are not going to be in the same condition or in the same area, are they? Well, they're not. And we're already seeing it now. And, you know, you're having a good, you know, you have off market deals. You have an amazing seller programs that you always talk about where you have cash deals and you could help people find deals. Um, but yeah, the, the homes are, as they go up in value, rates could also go up. And when rates go up, it diminishes your buying power. So if you don't like what you see today, you're not going to like it tomorrow because it's going to be more money and the price is going to be higher as well. And in speaking of those rates, what are they this week? And um, how is it that uh, what the projection for the next couple of months and six months and a year? What do you think? Well, I think in the next couple of months, no one ever has a crystal ball, but I think, you know, the jobs report usually drives rates. The inflation, people are a little nervous with inflation with all the stimulus package and all the programs that are being rolled out. How do you pay for it? Um, but what I can tell you with inflation and what you could tell them as a great realtor, um, as our currency diminishes, even if there is inflation, what's the best thing you can do to fight inflation is buy real estate, hard assets, right? So I'm telling people, if you're worried about your money going down, take it out now and buy real estate. So I think the rates are going to stay below 4%. Right now we're low threes. Um, so I think we're going to stay there for, you know, the next you know, year. I know the Fed came out and said they don't want to raise rates. So let's see what they, I don't know, but I think we're going to be below four. Five, five, five. <laughs> yeah. We would say that again if we weren't in the mortgage and real estate business. My husband, who's a financial planner, is just said that last night uh, with one of my clients. One of my clients, we took to dinner and he asked my husband, what should I do with my money? And my husband said, buy real estate. Well, it really is. And you want to diversify. And I think it's a great time to do just that. And you know where the deals are. You know where the new communities are. We know our coast inside out. You have 20 plus years. I have 20 plus years. So by using you and myself, it's 40 plus years of experience um, that we can really put, help people understand the market. And we never force people to buy. We show them an opportunity. We lay out a plan based on what their goals are. 
Uh, we always do a thorough interview up front to make sure this is what they want to do. This is what they want to buy. And then we help deliver on that. And we've helped you and I together, thousands of people over our 20 plus years. Um, and we can do the same for the people listening right now. So don't be scared. That's what I say. Don't be apprehensive. You can come up with a plan and then we can help execute it. And you don't have to jump right in. You can feel out the market. You can figure out what area you want to be in. Those are the fun part. But after you do your homework, yes, then you have to make a decision and you need to make a calculated decision and be very decisive in that decision. And I can say, and you can say, our people are very happy at the closing table. They're thrilled that they got the house or the condominium. They're happy. And we, that makes us happy. Yes. And Dave, what's a good number for them to text you and get a hold of you? Best number is area code 941-724-7653. I work nights and weekends. So whatever you need, just give me a call and I'll be happy to put my experience to help for you. Excellent. I appreciate your time this morning. We're both going to get back to work and you have a great and fun sunny day. You too, Sandra. Have a great day. Thank you. Good job. See you.